Today we're reviewing a 2010 V6 Mustang with an automatic transmission. Very aggressive looking. Small windshield. Small back seat. Pretty good tires. Fake scoop that doesn't do anything. Ford. Mustang. All right. So, like I said, this is a 2010 Mustang with the V6. It's putting out about 210 horsepower. And it's all right, you know. It's pretty good. But um, this is the four seat coupe. And I personally don't like coupes because it's a pain to get in the back seat. But if you're driving, who cares, you know? Yes, it is a V6 automatic, not my choice. So if it was my choice, it'd be a five speed manual, which they do come in a five speed manual. Weight in this car is about 3,400 pounds. That's pretty heavy for a car, but it is like you know American muscle car. So, and for a V6, it's really not that bad at all. The fuel tank holds about 16 gallons, which gets you where you need to go. I'm sure with the V8, that'd be a little bit different. V6 is a single overhead cam with 12 valves on it, and it's pretty reliable. Like, how, how many miles is on this? It's got 96,000. Yeah, it's not too bad. So Not too bad. Any major maintenance you had to do on it? Not really. Everything's been pretty good. That's it good. does have like a uh, windshield wiper fluid leak, but that's, that's about as major as it gets. Yeah, it's not bad at all for coming up on 100,000 miles. Zero to sixty pull. All right. Not too bad. There it is. About halfway to the next stop sign. The center console is pretty easy to use. It's all right, but one thing I don't like about it is the gear shift is like right in front of it so you kind of have to you know get your hands in there at an angle which i don't really like your trash control is right by the gear shift including your hazards and your trunk so and it's pretty reliable how many miles are on this car uh it's uh right now it's at 3300 82 000. you mean 33,000? no really how many wait how many miles 3,300. That's it? 82,000. Ah, 